Hi, welcome to another Voxvote video. This short video will explain some additional features on the multiple choice question type. Um, if you have a multiple choice question, you have multiple answer options in a list of multiple answers defined and with some special text instruction you can specify the number of votes to vote max or exactly. The difference will be explained uh, in a live uh, video. In here we have an example project um, with a question, for example, which countries in Europe are your favorite summer holidays? And of course somebody can vote on all, but we only want to have a list of maximum three. So you have to specify the three to the uh, user as read, readable, and this will be sent to the instruction. So it's a max with a semicolon, of a, no, it's called colon, and then uh, the, the three. So how will that look on the uh, uh, screen? We have another question about a singing context example, uh, which teams from the 16 in the shortlist could go to the next round. So here we specified the number two exactly here and we choose the exact um, two as uh, the list of two teams. This, so this won't be shown to the end user. Let's do a preview of the question type. Um, this is the special test number one, two, three, four, five, six. I'll choose the English answer. I now access the um, voting device on live.foxvote.com. Instructions can also be seen uh, in here. And here you can already see which users are uh, connected and currently we choose Tommy Cooper is my name as the test user for this event. We are in preview mode so I can test uh, more, choose the live mode only for the single one and now I'll start the question. And as soon as I start we can see that the text max 3 is stripped out of the uh, instruction text, also here and here. But the system knows it has to be validated as max3. So let's go to a list and select a 4 or 5, try to vote, and the answer is given. Maximum number of answers is 3. So that comes from the max3. Let's take these countries. And now my answer is cast. We had 12 votes, voters, and now I will refresh. And the 13th user is in. Let's do another question with the exact. So this is a, a, a long list of 16 uh, candidates. There's also an option to specify that I only want the top 10 of the uh, voters. Or if you say I want three top three only and you don't want to show the others. Um, it here it shows showing three results out of 16 options. I can also hide the message that we have a top three. Um, and I'll start a question. So given this is not percentage but this is set as a number of votes, let's vote to uh, Patricia's. Team D. So I vote. It says, oh, I have to specify at least two teams to go to the next round. So let's make the winner the Boca Juniors and the River Plati. And the winner is. Now with eight and seven. So in the summary, what we just saw, we specify the max with a column or exact with a column. Of course, you can do max one or exact uh, one, which is basically the default as it is normally. 
Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoy Voxout.